Hi, I'm over the all seeing Kim. We back to the channel with another one. If you can't tell, it's freezing. That's why I'm out here dressed like a Smurf real quick. If you can't tell, it's freezing. It's Brick City. So I had to get through this quick. I didn't even have time to go on live, but I still had to get this in for you guys. So we had to get it up. Supreme Week 4 drop list for March 16th, 2023, a.k.a. tomorrow. I keep waiting for Wednesdays because last season, every other season before this one, I always got the prices by Wednesday. Now I get the prices like super late Wednesday. So what can we do? Let's just get straight to it. Let me at least give the information and the reviews for this week's drop list. I don't got too much time to waste, so let's get straight into the Supreme Ima Bari pocket folding towel set of two all cotton terrier with jackard logo folds to pocket size. That's a crazy handkerchief. <laughs> Pull out a cotton handkerchief supreme though. You blow your nose on that shit. Nah, that's hard. That's hard. That's gross, but that's hard. Me, I would personally use like a fat boy rag. You guys know like them sweat rags when you're down in the south and it's super hot. Any of my rolling loud, any of my festival goers when it's super hot outside, you need that rag, bro. You could use it as a fan. You could use that shit at the back of your neck and just hold on to it and give a little Debo look. Makes your little biceps pop out. You sweat and you could rub your head down. Put it on top of your head if you don't got a hat and the sun's beaming. I'm just saying they're useful. They're useful. This one looks small though because keep in mind they're comparing it to a quarter size. So they're trying to show you how big it is. It looks like a quarter is already 25% of the size. It looks like if you stack at least four of those to six of those, you will complete the entire rack. So just keep that in mind. If you had to get a reference, put a quarter down and stack I'm saying it's four to five quarters. I would just do four just to say minimum because if it's bigger, you're not going to get mad. I would want to go to the minimum size and then see if that's worth it. There's actually measurements here. I don't even notice again. Five inches by nine by 9.9. .9. So if you have a ruler or anything like that, whichever way is easier for you. I like it. I'm not going to lie. And I also like that it comes in a set of two and you don't got to decide what color. It comes with one color of each. It comes with a black and a red. That's hard. I like that. I feel like this is a super fire gift as well. Like, if you're going to give me a gift and somebody gave me this, I don't think it's going to be that expensive. This is definitely under, like, 40 And I, I like it. This shit is fire. This is something I'm probably going to try to go for, no cap, just to have. Like, I don't even think I'm going to do anything with it. I have Rolling Loud rags I've never used again. Pull them out for festivals and shit like that. Or just pull them out just to be fancy. Bring them shits with me outside amusement parks and something. Either a sweat rag. Yeah, I can use it for that too. I didn't even think of it in amusement. That's a cop. That's a cop for sure. That's a cop. And I don't think that's going to be a high price point. All right, I'm not even going to edit out that part that the force quit popped up. My energy saver mode and my dumbass quicked it while talking to you guys. Like, uh, you're recording on OBS, stupid. That's why it's taking battery. Yo, kids, don't, don't hit bong before you start doing videos. Let me say that. Supreme Hodo 5-piece tool set. This shit is fire. Okay, now we getting turned up. Now we getting turned up. Supreme uh, five piece tool set includes 3.63 level torque, adjustable screwdriver with 10 alloy steel, S2 steel screwdriver bits, magnetic hammer with a rubber cap, adjustable spec. I wish you would be. Wrench, needle, uh, pliers, and tenon cells, tape measure. I just really need a tape, tape measure. Supreme tape measure is fire. This shit's hard though. Like, just picture having this shit. Everyone needs a screwdriver eventually, everyone needs a tool eventually. I'm king of needing shit. That I never have. Trust me, I don't have. I don't even want to say. I know I got like two hammers, two scissors. I think I got like a big ass metal, <laughs> a big ass metal ruler, like them shits you put against the house and you draw the lines on the wall. And I think that's maybe where it ends. No bullshit. I think that's maybe. I think I got like two Allen keys for my bike tools. Like, I'm telling you, my tool setup is gross. It's nasty. I don't even want to talk about it. It just makes me feel bad as a man. But this shit is fire, fire, fire. Like, not only does the dude got to be a fan of just tools. Like, even if you're a fan of tools and you just know of the brand Supreme, that's fire if somebody got that to you. Now, if you're like me, you're probably never going to use these tools because you're calling maintenance for anything that goes wrong. And AAA, if anything goes wrong with your whip, just fire to have. Like, bro, I'll keep this shit just for the drip. And it's a fire accessory. And if you're collecting accessories, this is super fire. The main thing I need is a damn tape measure because I'm always buying clothes and shit try, and, and I don't own a tape measure, which is the dumbest thing. And the little case for this, the toolbox is fire. I like this. This is fire, fire, fire. I just think it's going to be expensive. You guys know tools are not cheap. Supreme, I doubt they're going to make some cheap ass tools. Oh, they collabed with somebody. Hodo. I don't know who that is, but I'm assuming if they're making tools with Supreme, this five piece tool set's not going to be that cheap. I would still say cop. I'm not going to lie to you. Am I going to personally cop? Probably not because I feel like it's going to be super expensive, but... I think it's a cop for sure, for sure. Supreme Tamagotchi. What's crazy is that I remember the name Tamagotchi. I remember all this shit. And I was trying to think of my peoples a couple days ago. Like, yo, bro, did I have a Tamagotchi or was I too young for that? It feels good saying too young for that. Because some niggas trying to make me feel like a dinosaur today, too. Like, bro, I'm not even... Fuck 40. I'm not even 30 yet. And niggas trying to make me sound like, this nigga's old as shit. I'm like, 
Wow, like where did this come from? I swear it wasn't like this when I was a kid, bro. Like Jesus Christ. Some niggas make you feel old as soon as you hit 25, bro. You were old head. I'm like, who made this rule? Who who's the young gatekeeper? Like who's the gatekeeper making the rules of the youth? Like, nah, this is some bullshit. But the Tamagotchi, release it in three colors. You get a camouflage pink, camouflage green, and camouflage black and white. So I, what I remember from these is, and you can tell from the LED screen, I didn't look it up, but what I remember was you have a pet, and then you just, I believe, like, see, you could do shit. Feed the pet, play with the pet, pause, give it its shots. I don't know what that is, what that is, but you can you can interact with, with, your, with your pet, is what I'm trying to say. And then it continues growing. Like, it starts at an egg. You see there, it's like a little baby, and now it's a full ducky. It's just something that it's, just like it's, it's for the 90s babies, you get me? I feel like it is for the 90s kids, bro. Let me know down below if you're gonna go for a Tamagotchi. So that's a dope keychain, don't get me wrong. Like, that's a cool keychain. It's something cool to hang off your keychain. I don't know how the battery life works on it. It's an LCD display. I'm sure the batteries last forever. But you guys let me know down below if you're getting or going for this. I don't know if there's any hype around it right now. By the likes and dislikes, I'm sure that there's gonna be a little of a, that there's gonna be a hype going around this. I don't know. Something's just telling me. It's a Gen 1, too. I don't know what that means, but you see right there, Gen 1. I don't know. I'm going to do more research on it and see if I cop. I like accessories. I like 90s throwback. I like retro shit. So I would say cop for sure, for sure, for sure. And if you was a fan of these, then why not? If you was a fan of them, you probably want to get your hand on one alone just to get... I don't know if they're hard to get, if they still make them and shit. I just think of back in the day when I see stuff like this. I think the hardest one of all, I'm not going to lie to you, is the pink. Let me know down below if you guys are going for it or not. I think it's a cop for sure. I think it's a cop. Nothing that makes me go too crazy, but I'll look the hype on them and shit. Maybe so I could reflip. Worldwide hooded sweatshirt. On the back, we got Supreme Worldwide. R RN number. Um, North America distributes. Uh, United States, Canada, Mexico, Asia. So it's just showing you all the distributions everywhere. Established. 1994. Contact. You can email them. Website. All right, so basically, you just a walking business card. Nah, because now I feel like this is a slap to my face. Y'all niggas got me doing business card shit for free. Like, nah, I'm good. I don't know. It just goes against my ego. Like, this is kind of crazy. This is kind of crazy. Like, now I'm paying to market y'all niggas. Like, that's insane. Instead of them paying me to wear that hoodie, I'm wearing this shit. I'm going to sit this one out. I'm going to definitely skip this one. We ain't even see the colors it dropped in. I just wanted to go straight to that back. <clears throat> Hoodie releasing, pullover releasing in a couple colors. Had the gray, orange, brown, blue, and black. I like that blue. Because my shit's like a dull blue. This is an old Supreme. I don't know if you guys remember, like, the Nick colorway one. <coughs> it's that Supreme going around the letters and shit. It's a little beat up. I think it's, like, 2019, I want to say. 2019 drop, maybe? 2019 or 2020, I forgot. This is skip for me. I just don't like the back of it because the back of it just hurts my ego. Like, this shit kind of make me feel like I'm some businessman shit. Like, I'm a walking business card. I'm going to sit out. Nigga, the about me section from supreme.com. Like, nah, I'm going to sit this out. Shit is disrespectful. Now, if this was something that could have been, like, if this is something that's for the low ski, which I know it's not because it's a pullover, it's probably going to be 150 or, like, something like, yo, if you spend 300 you get a business card hoodie, then, yeah, hell yeah, you spend 500 I would have bullshit just to buy it and get the hoodie. At that point, then it makes me want to get the hoodie. Me paying for it? No. <clears throat> that just seems like an like, like add-on. Gradient box logo New Era. You guys know I'm trying to collect Supreme New Era hats. Is this one that will be added to my Supreme collection? I ain't going to hold you. That patch on the side is crazy fire. That patch on the side is crazy fire. I like how it's the Supreme Box logo on the front. My favorite is that blue and that orange. I can't even see that orange from the front. I just don't like the white stitching. Do they all got white stitching? Do they all got white stitching? Damn, I really don't like that white stitching. Pink got black stitching. Is that the only one that, damn, like I would have digged the black stitching. And then, oh no, because some of them got black, they all got black stitching on the actual hat. It's just the brim. That's even stupider. Like, why y'all going to do the black stitching all around the hat and then give me this white true religion stitching on the brim? Like, come on, y'all niggas will do shit to get me tight on purpose. I swear to my mother. Because this navy with the, with, the, with the gradient, like, I like it. I'm not even going to hold you. I do like it. The only shit killing me is them dumbass white stitching on the, on the, on the thing, like. And it's not the worst. Don't get me wrong. Like, I don't hate the white stitching that much, but. And I can see the orange got the white stitching too on the brim. Like, why y'all did me like this, bro? 
Why y'all did me like this? I would have really copped that. I like the box logo. I even like. I'm not even mad at the colors. The brown's hard too. No bullshit. That brown's hard too. And I really like the patch on the side. That patch on the side is fire. Like I really like the patch on the side. I'm gonna see them when they drop and get a better look at them. Right now it's a skip off the just a single fact that they got the white stitching on the brim. If not. Bro, I would 100% cop this blue right here. 100% cop this blue. I'm still thinking about copping this blue, but I don't know how I feel about those white stitching on the brim. That shit is got me tight. Shit gave me the, the gas reflex. Like, ah! Had to turn me to Wyatt and NJ. Ah! It's the coochie man. Like, nigga, shit turned me to that. I was tight. Small box striped sweater. Releasing in five colors. Purple, cream, pink, Black and olive green. They're loving that olive green. <clears throat> They're lucky olive, olive green. I just wasn't expecting so much olive green for spring, summer. I, that's more of a fall, winter color for me. But I ain't mad at This shit would be hard. And I'm not even trying to like this because this shit is, you could wear it for a lot of occasions. I'm not trying to this, but this is some shit my pops would have wore. Like if I'm trying to get my pops a drip of Supreme, he's been in a Republic head. But to get my Dominican father and some Supreme, this shit is fire right here. No bullshit. Like for him. I see my pops right in this olive green right here. This is his color, too. He loves olive green and navy blue like me. This olive green right here. I bought him a whole Banana Republic, like four things from Banana Republic last year. All olive green. Nah, that shit is hard. That shit is hard. I like it. I like it a lot. Yeah. I'm going to skip it personally. But if you're trying to get your father a holiday gift or some shit, or his birthday's coming up and you don't know what to get him, and your dad be dressing like this, but you want to spice up his shit and add a little stilo, add a little swag to him and get him in some supreme this is hard. This is even some shit that I probably would think about doing some shit like that. Like, if I lived with my father, that's a fire content video right there. Get my dad this hoodie. Make him unbox it and him tell us how he feels about it. Boom. But when you're a kid that looks like me, we don't really have that option. Daddy, please come home. <laughs> but if you have a father that lives with you or a father that lives close, buy this hoodie and see what he thinks. Flock denim trucker jacket. So, hold on. Flock denim trucker jacket. <clears throat> All kind 13 ounce denim with distressed flocking print. Button front closure with on seam hand pockets at lower front and button flap patch pockets at chest. Tab adjustable at cuffs and back heme with leather logo patch. Metal logo plate at back neck. I don't know why that shit felt like I was reading a goddamn riddle. I was trying to see how I really felt about it. All right, I got something popping up. It looks like my lunch is about to end. So let's just get through this quickly. This rusty right here. This tetanus shot. It looked a little spicy when I opened it. And I'm, I know there's niggas that could kill this for sure. I know there's dudes that would kill this for sure. This is some shit you can't wear too much either, though. Like, this shit gonna get somebody annoyed. This is some shit that you rocking and be like, oh. The first time you wear that, this nigga is stabbed. You wear that shit the next week. That shit's fire. That's cool. All right. I see what you did again. All right. Week three. That Supreme Denim. That shit warm, right? That shit must be comfortable. Fifth time you wear this shit, nigga's going to be annoyed. I'm tired of this nigga in this highlighter ass velour denim jacket. Like, that's it, bro. That's it. They're going to stop. This nigga, we pulling up with the Supreme jacket like he doing something. Like, I'm telling you, that's, the, that's, that's what you're going to get with this shit. I'm good. I'm going to sit this one out. Patchwork leather cargo vest. Okay. Okay. California love. That's the vibe I get instantly. Skin leather with patchwork pattern and taffeta lining. Full zip closure with on seam hand pockets. Zip and patch utility pockets at lower front and chest. Interior chest pocket and size adjusters at waist. Work smarter, not harder. I don't know, this shit really giving me a Tupac vibe. Like, this shit really giving me a Tupac vibe. If the back would have said Supreme on some biker gang shit, I would have joined. No bullshit, I would have joined. If this shit would have said Supreme on the back, that's what I was waiting to see. She got like an Edward Scissors back, but I was expl I was expecting to see like some Supreme shit. You don't know, like Blade, this shit like you really came to tear shit up. Like, you really came on some demonial time. It ain't bad, though. This shit kind of hard, bro. I'm not going to hold you. This shit kind of hard, but why couldn't it have that box logo like it has it right there in the center of the back? Bro, this shit would have been the hottest piece of the week. Like, this shit would have been the hottest piece of the week. I would have been wearing this shit in the summer. This shit would have had a big Supreme box logo dead in the back. Which I don't even like loud shit like that all the time. You guys know I'm more of the quiet duel. But that should have been hard on this vest. Like on some biker gang patch, that should have been hard. I would have went with that look. The front ain't even bad either with all these pockets and shit. Shit is smooth. Is this something I'm gonna go for? Definitely not. But it's not bad. If you if you if you into if you into cheap casino cigarettes and riding motorcycles, this shit got your name on it, brother. Like this shit would be fire. You'll really be stepping. The black is hard. The cream is crazy. 
You wearing an all white suit with that cream vest? Nah, you you out here at a baby shower or you going to meet God? Like one of the two. That's that's the only way I can see me wearing that shit in an all white fit. I'm either in Miami, baby shower, or I'm going to meet God. Like nah, I'm good. The black is harder, but I'm gonna sit out of both. You guys let me know. That's a skip for me, but I, I see what y'all was doing there. I see what y'all was doing there. That's a, it. Depends on your lifestyle. That's what that 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 one. It depends on your lifestyle. If your lifestyle goes with that leather and you need a leather, then yeah, that grab it. World famous micro hooded sweatshirt. I was gonna say I could barely even see what this shit said. World famous since 1994 Supreme. This is releasing in is there back print? Oh no, it's just zoomed up to the chest. Alright. Nothing on the back, I'm assuming. Yeah, nothing on the back. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Just show me all the colors at once. Show me, show me, y'all. Alright, releasing in green, blue. Red, purple, white, and black. I do like that green. I've never seen a green Supreme hoodie in this shade. I have not yet. I like this. I like this. I like this. Usually, I would have, like, it's cool, but nah, I like this. I like this a lot due to the print. The only reason I'm not copping is because I need to get my summer game up, bro. I'm slacking, slacking on shorts and tees. Like, I need t-shirts. I need shorts. I have so much hoodies. That's all I buy. I just bought mad hoodies because I lived up north in the cold, and I was wearing hoodies and... Wearing hoodies for, what, 9 out of 12 months up north? So I thought I was hoodie game crazy. Now, I need some t-shirts, bro. I need t-shirts and shorts emergency. Block Arc SS. All cotton slub jersey with tackle twill logo applicable. All cotton slub jersey with tackle twill logo. Uh, Release it in a handful of colors. Maroon, gray, green, white, blue, and black. What does the front say? Oh, it says Supreme. It's just the font. It's so hard to read. Uh, I'm going to personally skip this one. We got to speed up because I got something to do. But I'm going to skip this one. You guys let me know if this is something you're going for. I'm going to skip, 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 these skip. City Patches 6 panel. Los Angeles, Manhattan, New York, London, Supreme, New York, Supreme. I see they just got patches of all the stores going around is what I'm assuming. This shit ain't bad. This is kind of cool. This shit kind of give me like a designer look. I ain't mad at it. No bullshit. I'm not mad at it. It's just a little too loud for me, but I'm not mad at it. I don't know. Something about it is kind of hard to me. It's kind of hard. I think it's a cop. Am I going to personally cop? No, but I think it could be a cop if it goes with your style and shit. I kind of like that green again. I don't know why I'm so, I'm so green, right? I don't know why I'm feeling all this green shit today, but definitely I'm feeling that green. All right, let's speed this up. Flocked regular jean, all kind 13 ounce denim with the stress flocking. You guys know I'm going to say skip, so let me just say skip. I always tell you guys, don't listen to me for jeans because I never bought any or even seen Supreme jeans in person. Don't know how they fit. So I want to know how their regulars fit. I just don't like this print either way for both of these on some pants. Nah, I'm good. Too much, too much retro vibe. That should really remember, remind me of my childhood. Work pant. Here, you see? Now some shit like this. All right, cool. They're giving you like that. All right, bad, bad, bad. Work pant, heavy cotton blend twill, like a, like a slack chino vibe. Cool. If you're still working in the office, I would have copped that navy. That's what I was saying. I'm like, yo, I haven't, I never bought no really supreme work shit. Like, for the office and shit, when I was back in the office and shit. Like, today, if I'm in the office, bro, I'm supreme down. Like, I'm going to be the supreme in the office just with a whole bunch of button ups and shit like that. So, cop if you're working in the office. If you sit at home and you don't think you're going to get a use for it or you don't dress like that on your weekends and regular free time, then probably not. Patchwork leather five pocket jean. Lambskin leather. All right, releasing the same two. What's crazy is I was just telling myself, you need some leathers, bro. I be seeing niggas stepping in some leathers sometime. I wanted some stacked leathers. Like, I don't know why. That's crazy to say, but I wanted some leather. These shits right here, they cool. Let me see the back of them. Let me see the back of them. I was hoping that Supreme was not blacked out, but I see they blacked it out. Kind of makes sense with the design, though, at that point that you're going to black it out. Uh, if you're a leather owner, I would say cop. If you're not scared to try new things in fashion, I would say cop. Me, personally, I'm pussy. So I'm gonna say skip. Metallic long sleeve top, releasing in three colors: brown, black, and like a grayish blue. No Supreme callouts outside, I don't believe. So if you're really on your quiet shit, this shit just got a cursive S. That shit just got a cursive S. Metallic cotton blend with embroidered logo. Yeah, this shit is definitely a skip for me. Now, even though I was in the office, still a skip. Croc patch SS work shirt. I hate it, but. I don't like it, but let's look a little more into it. Releasing in, 
Yeah, I, 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 I'm gonna go with my first emotion. I really dislike this shit. This shit is mad Spanish. Like, I don't know why I just see a Spanish nigga in the club with this shit on. Like, nah. Teal, white, black. Nah, this shit is a dub, 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 dub. This shit is a dub. It's one of the something that my primos were having Santo Domingo. Like, nah, that shit is a dub. With the Supreme in the front. Nah, that shit is a dub. Croc skin, too, though. So, like, nah, you probably gonna think you doing something. Like, you really stepping, but nah, that shit is a dub for me. Again, this is something I can see niggas killing, though. Don't get me wrong. Like, I can see a fly nigga wearing this shit. Some high, some high water. You know what I mean? Wearing, like, the high water slack pants skinny with, like, some white socks. And then you got, like, some low top Doc Martens on. Like, some shades on. Nah, you know that vibe. You know that. Me, personally, though, I'm going to sit up. I'm going to skip that. You guys let me know if you like it or don't. I don't care if it's croc. I don't like it. Crochet edge hat. Hand crocheted, it's like a beanie hand crocheted. I feel like on a John, this would be fire. This cream one right here would be fire, fire, fire. If you got a hipster John, this is a fire purchase for Like, I don't really even know if my John really wear this shit like that. I feel like, I feel like you need the right hipster John for this piece and it'll be tough, don't get me wrong. Like, I, I could visualize her in my head, like little curly afro shit loose, she got this shit on, boom, with some Supreme on, some Vans and some Chucks on, like that vibe, that's the vibe that I'm seeing. And she got like that long ass, like you know I be wearing my messenger bag, one of them shits. <laughs> A Supreme one, though, like my, my messenger. Just not Cordura, like a different material. But you guys understand what I'm saying, bro. We all know that one hipster girl. And I think she would kill this. Me? Nah. I'm gonna sit this shit out personal. You know who else I see in this mad random? I'm trying to think back to that style, like a Janae Aiko. She's another one. Mariah the Scientist, kind of that vibe. Not their outfits. Janae more how she dresses, not Mariah much, but but like their vibe, if you understand where I'm going with this. Other than that, I'm good. Drop list for week four, March 16th, tomorrow at 11 a.m. If you have any questions or you wanna know any more information, make sure you hit me up. This shit is actually dropping. I try to wait till last minute to see if I can get you guys the prices. But no, it did not come up. Same thing happened last week. So at this point, we'll just we'll just go back to doing the videos on Tuesday. And I'll just have to think of a way to update you guys to the prices. Or if you have any questions, just always hit me up. And I'll give you guys the prices when I have it. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Comment down below. We're on the road to 5,000 subs. So sub up, sub up, sub up. And until next week, if we do an unbox, we got a whole bunch of unboxings to do. Not many Supremes, but a whole, whole, whole lot of other brands that are super fire. Some brands you've seen in this channel, some brands are going to be new to this channel. So we got to get to those ASAP. If you have any questions, let me know down below. Subscribe to the channel, like this video, and like I love to say until the next one. We out here. I really like a Smurf with all this blue on, bro. Like, oh, that's crazy. Gang banging, gang banging, gang banging. <laughs>